So now how exactly does the enzyme increase the rate of a chemical reaction? So let us see the first graph over here. The ultimate goal of the reaction is like we've always been discussing, a substrate molecule needs to get converted into a product molecule. Every substrate molecule will already have a certain amount of energy in it, which already has energy in it, which is referred to as potential energy. Okay. Now a substrate needs to get converted to a product. Now imagine that there is no enzyme. Without the enzyme, notice all of you, for the substrate to get converted into the product, it needs an additional input of energy called activation energy. So it is asking for more activation energy in the absence of enzyme and therefore it will take a longer time for the substrate in order to reach a point in this curve to reach a climax um, a state which is called the transition state where it is undergoing a lot of changes in its bonds etc where it is finally transforming into the product so it is demanding for more energy activation energy you can consider it as the extra push that the substrate molecule requires in order to reach the higher energy state that is called the transition state look at the shorter graph now we have an enzyme with us now notice that very quickly it is reaching the peak of the graph very quickly it is reaching the transition state that means it did not demand for more activation energy in the first case it demanded for a greater activation energy and so it reached the peak after a little while but in the second graph as you can see it demands for less activation energy and when it demands for less activation energy it is reaching the peak of the graph that is the peak of the curve which represents the higher energy state or the transition state much quicker than the first graph isn't it so activation energy with the enzyme is the enzyme is in the presence of the enzyme the substrate is asking for less activation energy less push so the push required is less in this case whereas in the second in the first one which i'm showing with a double arrow the push required is greater so enzyme will make sure that the substrate asks for a lesser push meaning it will ask for a lesser activation energy so the right way of saying this is it lowers the demand for activation energy by the substrate